Good morning, everybody. We're here again in the Arboretum on a nice sunny morning in April. It's not windy, which is always nice in New Mexico when we have a, a day that's calm and quiet and sunny. Let's start off today by looking at this purple flowered cactus. It's called a Bonkers Hedgehog Cactus. It's named after a female botanist named Frances Bonkers. She's one of two botanists that have plants named after them that we have in the refuge in the Arboretum River. This little cactus inside the fence isn't blooming yet, but I want to say something about the fence. We've had trouble getting this little cactus. It's, it's a May acantha. It's a uh, a mammalaria. We've had trouble getting it to grow because something eats it, probably a pack rat or a mouse. So we finally put a fence around it to protect it. This is one of our shrubs that's blooming right now. It's a little leaf sumac, very common in the arroyos in the desert. It's a native to the refuge and to the Chihuahuan desert. Likes a bit more moisture. See if you can get this fly right here. See him? Oh, there we go. It's just also starting to leaf out, but it's covered with flowers. If you go hiking in the arroyos, you'll see it growing along with the mesquite and the salt bush and the creosote bush. One of my favorites because it's successful because we've managed to keep these alive and thriving is a primrose. This is called a stemless evening primrose. These flowers fade very quickly like this one bloomed this morning and has already faded. That one looks like it's been eaten by something. Just a quick look at one of the stars of the show. One of the prettiest Christmas joyas that probably any of us will ever see. Covered with red seed pods. Those are last year's flowers that have made seed pods and they're still on the plant. Finally, we look at this little cactus. It's called an old man of the desert. This is the first time in five years that I've seen it bloom. So I read a little bit about it and it looks like it takes up to 20 years for this cactus species to bloom. It has to get to a certain size and age. It's a clumping cactus, although it's not an Echinocerus like the other hedgehog cactuses, but it's got little offsets that are cropping up around it. 